Hey treasure hunters, welcome back to Toolbox Treasures. My name's Trav, and today we have a ton of stuff to cover with you guys. Um, a lot of different toy brands, uh, a lot of different uh, manufacturers, but we're gonna keep it all mega constructs. Uh, we've got some new stuff to share with you guys that is out in our community and some stuff that's coming into your community. Um, but before we get into what we got, if you're new to our channel and you like our content, hit the subscribe button, turn your bell on for notifications, and if you think we did a good job, give us a thumbs up, and check us out on Facebook because we do drop extra content on our Facebook page. Uh, we are almost at 100 subscribers, so we are at 92, we need eight more, so uh, community members, help us out. Let's get that, let's get that milestone hit 100 uh, so we can keep growing. So first off, went out and checked the mail this morning, and I had this in the mail. So this is the new uh, Predator Mega Constructs with the uh, thermal imaging uh, Dutch and a new Predator. Now I bought two of these things. I pre-ordered these, pre-ordered these things like months ago, and they finally just showed up. Um, it's been so long I haven't even checked the tracking, so it was <laughs> it was really a surprise uh, for them to be in the mail. Um, so I, they're, they're ten bucks, man. So this is this is a great investment if you're into uh, into, into toys and toy collecting because it's very budget friendly. Uh, so what we have we have the original Dutch. Okay, this guy was five bucks a few months back, and now we have thermal imaging Dutch. So this guy is cool. So I love the uh, the color scheme. So if you're a Predator fan, you know what this is all about. Uh, he's got this real cool blade. Uh, he's got him an AR and this cool pink pistol, which I'm not a pink guy, but I think it looks really cool. I, I think the pink goes really well. Um, and then, of course, the camo uh, is top notch. Uh, this may be the best figure Mega Constructs has done to date, in my opinion. Um, and then we got the new Predator. So. We got the the old one here, and then we got this one. So the only thing different I can tell from these guys is this one, the new one, has green eyes, and the old one has black eyes. But I love the skulls, um, and I really like this uh, laser beam that they got. Um, I'm gonna be taking these guys to work because I like to have a little toy collection at work, um, as well, of course, here at HQ. Uh, these guys don't take up a lot of room. They don't take a lot of space. They're not very expensive. So I love taking them to work and be able to, uh, I kind of jumble them around sometimes just to make it fresh, make it new. Uh, but they're cool. I love the articulation. So it's a, if, if you're looking for something to take to work with you, these guys are it. Uh, so they make real cool displays. So also, while we are out looking for all the Motu stuff that's over the rage and all the G.I. Joe stuff that everybody's going crazy for, uh, we run across the new Alien Eggs uh, from Mega Constructs. So we have the old ones here. This was the, the first series. Um, and I picked up the display box. So uh, these things are numbered on the bottom if you don't know that. Uh, so w if you look close enough, I don't know if I can get this close enough for you guys. Uh, let's see if I can line it up. Well, I can't see it myself. There we go. So if you get up real close. There's some numbers here right there. And what you're looking for is you're looking for the last digit. There it is. So if you're looking for the last digit, you want to look at that four. So these things have a four, a six, and a seven. Uh, so each number represents which egg you're going to get with which uh, which aliens in it, because there's two to a bot or two to an egg. So uh, so this you know four, six, and seven. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to open one up, and we're going to at least find out what's in it. Uh, so when you open these things up. Uh, they got a real cool pouch, and it's got slime, and it's got the uh, the figures in it, and you got to dump the slime out, and you got to put the figures together. You know, it, I think it's cool. I love it. I think it's one of the neatest things that they got on the market today. Uh, so this is the four, and the four is going to be the black. And what's the other one? And the white. So this is going to be black and white. So it comes with instruction, tells you what you got. 
Um, so the four is going to be these guys. This is what you're going to get in the four. So it comes in this pouch. And you can see the slime um, and the figures in there. So let's go ahead and tear this open. Check that out. Ain't that the coolest thing you've ever seen? And the slime peels really well off the off the figure, so don't really worry about them getting on the. So they they just it just peels, you know, it just peels right off. And it comes with face huggers and little stands and stuff. So these things. I, I love playing with these things. I think it's really cool. Uh, what I'll do is I'll put the slime in a Ziploc bag and then stuff it all back in the egg. Uh, because I, I like the slime. I think it's cool when it came with it. So um, I think it, it was, it's worth saving anyway. Until it dries up, then we'll throw it away. Uh, it's one of them things that you may not think about that you may want later uh, a few years down the road if you decide to sell it, trade it, whatever. At least... If it's open, you can at least say that you had the slime to go with it. So I'm pulling these guys apart. Um, these things are real generic. They're all the same. Uh, they're just using different plastic, color plastic. Um, and they just snap together real easy. There's your tail. Now the legs can be a little difficult uh, because there's not a lot of room for you to get it in there. So, right there's your alien, your xenomorph. Uh, this one looks like gray, not black. I thought it was black, but it looks it's gray. So, the four is going to be the gray and the white. Uh, so, let's get into, this is a six. So, the six is going to be the red... And the brown so your six is going to be these guys right here so that means that your seven is going to be the purple and the green um, and each each one of them has different color slime so you have the white and the gray had green slime looks like this red one here has red slime in it and the seven with that purple one looks like it's got blue it's blue slime so we we opened these things up for you. We gave you a look, see what they see what they are. Uh, you know, slime reminds me of Nickelodeon. It reminds me of my childhood. So that's kind of the reason I keep it. Uh, so at the store, there was nine of these things. We only took what we needed because I was pervy to the uh, to the numbers because of the original line. I was able to figure that out. Uh, so when you're when you're buying these things, check the bottom. That way you know what you're getting. That way you don't have to buy, you know, 10 of these things to get what you want. So that way you can only buy three and you can let somebody else have some. So uh, we got our Mega Constructs. We got our Predators. We got our Alien Slime. Uh, and we left a lot of stuff out there for everybody else. Uh, stay tuned next week because we do have some really cool stuff to share with you. And I'm hoping to get some more stuff to go with it. Uh, always leave something on the shelf for the next person because the next person may be you. It may be me. I left one of these things out there too. Um, and keep digging in boxes because you never know what you're going to find. They find an alien egg in a box like I did. And uh, stay tuned for future videos. Uh, we're trying to get those last eight subscribers. So share our community, make it bigger, make it grow. And uh, thanks for tuning in. Be kind to one another.